Hey guys, anyways, LP here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to get media controls on your widget for the home screen of iPhone if you listen with Apple Music and or Spotify. So in this video, we're going to go over how to achieve this directly on your iOS device. You can interact with the controls. You can actually fast forward, go back, play and pause your music directly from the widget on the home screen of your iPhone. Now there's certain limitations. iOS widgets normally can't do this. This developer is using a really nifty trick to get around these restrictions and I'm going to show you a few things you need to know before you download Widget Pods. Now Widget Pod is four stars in the App Store. It is pretty good ratings here and is available right now. There's a premium version and then there's a free version. The premium tier is $1.99 and it offers the actual controls on the home screen as well as Spotify support. So if we head on over to the application itself, it's very very simple to use. So on the top left here you have all of your controls for the actual app you have sync to iCloud you have your display options you also have your icon where you can change the notifications the playback controls you also have Apple Music and Spotify support as I mentioned Apple Music will be your default Spotify comes with the premium tier which is $1.99 as of the filming of this video and down here you also have some additional information where you can contact a developer and so forth I'll link everything in the description on the top right here you have two sizes for the widget you have small and a medium. Now I've already created a medium size one so I'm just going to create in small just for the purpose of the video here and as you can see here you can theme your actual widget as well. You can go light or dark mode. You can invert that. You can also get access to different options to change different settings here. Now I usually like to change the actual icon for the Apple Music on the top there. Simple thing to do. You can actually change anything within the elements there. You also have the action when you tap the widget. As of right now I have it to bring me directly to the application just like that you also have your uh, icon controls as well you have some customization options here and one really cool option here is you can have blur the background of the actual widget have a solid color or a custom image for the background of the actual widget and other controls down here as well where you can remove certain things and elements from the widget itself so once you have your widget set up all you have to do is go back into the home screen of course go into edit mode click the plus icon and then select the application with the widget click add and then you're going to select the music player or the actual music streaming service by tapping and actually selecting the size of the widget here and once you start playing whichever music you prefer it will show up on the top right so if you want apple music apple music shows up if you want spotify obviously spotify would work now as you can see here i can fast forward through the tracks right on the home screen of iphone but if you don't have this option turned on so let's head on over to accessibilities and then motion if you do not have reduce motion turned on this is what it's going to look like it's going to sort of skip just like that but the developer has a nifty trick where you can just go ahead and click on the reduce motion and you don't have to worry about that actually opening up the widget and that's a restriction built into iOS by the way where the actual widget can't really have any interaction without having to open the host application but in this case it looks like that's a really good workaround I love this application check it out in the app store again free for the actual widget application $1.99 for the controls and the Spotify support I hope you guys enjoyed this one I really love it thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.